It's a very, very special time of the year because this thing right here is celebrating its fourth birthday. Four years! Now, what is inside here? There is a McDonald's cheeseburger right there. There is a McDonald's apple pie, which is right there. Both of them are brown and very ooey and gooey. And then we have some McDonald's fries right here that have turned into a orangey brownish kind of crust with a little bit of a whitish kind of whipped cream look to it. Here is the same thing. Now the difference between these two obviously is this one is sealed within its own moisture, airtight somewhat, since 2020, May 30th, 2020 to be exact. And this one was uh, left out into the open around the same time in 2022. So this is four years old and this is two years old. Like the first couple of years, it really went through a huge evolution or de-evolution, however you want to uh, say. And uh, a lot of people see it and they just automatically get grossed out. But hey, that is just what, it's science, everybody. So I started this experiment about a year into this YouTube channel and the podcast and everything, just because I always wanted to try something different, something new. And I always saw all of these things, uh, stories, people putting uh, a cheeseburger, McDonald's cheeseburger into a cabinet, and then they go years later and, oh, it's the same thing. Uh, this is what they're talking about, this. Yeah, if you leave any kind of food, McDonald's food or otherwise, out into the open air, it's either going to decompose because maybe it's like strawberries or something, or if it's like bread or meat or anything like that, yeah, it's just going to get very, very hard. So I wanted to prove to people, because no one ever done this before, that McDonald's or whatever other kind of food, if in the right environment in its own moisture like this, will it change? Will it grow mold? Will it decompose properly? And the answer is, after four years, look at this. Yes, it does. Because uh, there's a lot of people that, oh, this is fake food. McDonald's is fake food. See, it doesn't even decompose. It's like, you can, do, you can make a burger at home and set it out in the open and it'll look just like this. So uh, that, that's the whole point I was trying to prove. And plus also, I'm just weird in general, and I enjoy fun science experiments like this and uh, just checking in on it. So yeah, happy four years to the McDonald's Jewel Box here, and hopefully many, many more birthdays ahead. And before we get into checking and updating you on what has happened in the past four years, let's go back to where it all began and just go through very quickly the evolution of the McDonald's Jewel Box. That like so. To make sure you're not, I'm not fooling you, I'm showing you everything. This is what the cheeseburger looks like. And there we go, it's got the onions, got the pickle. You know what, let's just set it right on the bottom there. It's probably the best idea, anyways. There we go. Apply a nice bead of caulk. So, there you go, guys. This is contained for all eternity now. We've got the cheeseburger, we've got the fries, and we've got the uh, apple pie. Hot apple pie, soon to not be. We're going to check in on this for years to come and um, see what happens to this food over time. Okay, one, two, three, four. Happy birthday to you. Welcome to the McDonald's Jewel Box and the McDonald's Jewel Unbox update for May 2024. 
Now we are taking a look at the cheeseburger, apple pie, and the fries here in the McDonald's Jewel Box. This has been sealed within its own moisture since May 30th, 2020. And this is the same thing, but it's been left out in the open since May of 2022. Now this is all hard and petrified and whatever, but this has seen a different take. So this is what McDonald's food that's been sitting out for four years within its own moisture looks like. Take a nice gander there. The fries are whipped creamy. That's what they look like at least, that's mold. And they are brown and orange as well. There are these black little specks here that have been growing for quite a while now. And uh, the cardboard sleeve has slowly gotten a yellow tint to it, as well as some white molding on the sides here. So there is the fries. And the cheeseburger is the grossest thing within this box. There's still some brown look to it that kind of resembles an actual cheeseburger. The cheese that has been hanging out there has turned into a nasty brown as well. It looks like a brown pancake in a way with some very caramelized brown sugar topping, but don't let that fool you. That is just some nasty blob. This looks like something that uh, is in a sewage waste containment system. And yeah, so there is the cheeseburger. Now taking a look at the pie, the pie has finally started to deteriorate quite a bit. We were waiting on it. The pie held up the most out of the fries and the cheeseburger. This is the one that really put up a fight. But as you see now, it looks like it has dollops of chocolate icing on it or whatever. But yeah, it's not chocolate. That definitely ain't chocolate. In the McDonald's Jewel Unbox, everything is the same. Still, everything is just hard as a rock. But that is about it. Thank you guys for watching. This has been the McDonald's Jewel Box and the McDonald's Jewel Unbox for May of 2024. Happy four years to the McDonald's Jewel Box and happy two years to the McDonald's Jewel Unbox. Thank you guys for watching. I will see you next month.